Guys, QBM Productions here. Today I'm going to tell you, show you my Lego Fortnite custom mini figures slash skins that I have made. So we have nine mini figures that we're going to be reviewing. So up first is the Raptor. The Raptor was pretty easy to make. I just used that face. Uh, I just used like a Lloyd helmet as the mask. I might change it and then I use like this brown coat and then his leg. So it was a pretty easy figure to make. I I think the skin is cool in the game. Next we have Rox. So Rox is from season nine the season nine bow pass uh she uh she's a pretty cool skin i have her uh and i just used one of the styles i, I used the i put i made the style that was right before she had the helmet because i felt like the helmet would be too hard i can try but yeah Uh, next up is Midas, who is a skin that came out a few weeks ago. Uh, he's the tier 100 for the, the chapter 2, season 2 battle pass. He's a pretty cool skin. I don't have him. I'm really close. I'm like tier 75. It was a pretty easy figure to make. I just made like his scar and then I... Try putting his gold eye on the right. And then I just put like a little suit on him. Next is the Omega, which is from the season four battle pass. So this skin came out a while ago. Uh, this actually was kind of a pretty uh, hard figure. Uh, I just used like this helmet and put it uh and then i made like this head like there's the orange visor and i put like armor on and uh here are the lights i know they didn't come out too well and then i just put out these legs next up we have the reaper who is a pretty cool skin they actually were were Reaper is based off of John Wick, and then they made a John Wick in Season 9. Uh, the hairpiece, I see people using either the hair that hairpiece that's on rocks or this hairpiece. And then since that was on rocks, I just decided to use this. And then I just used this face and this suit, and it came out pretty good. Next is Iconic, which is a pretty cool skin. This hood comes off kind of easy. I just, like, put some Sharpie, like, a mask on this face because I know I couldn't put a Ninjago thing, a Ninjago face mask in there. So I just did that, and then I, uh, this kind of looked like a sweatshirt. I mean, I don't have too many sweatshirt Legos, so I just used that and then put, like, red in there and I used these legs I might like color over that black and then I uh, just put these arms on uh, I really want this skin but it it's just really hard to get since uh, it's a galaxy skin next is the dark bomber which is one of my favorite skins in Fortnite this was uh, it was a complicated skin to make, but I managed to, um, I was thinking about making the Bright Bomber, but I don't have her, and I like the Dark Bomber better, so I just made the Dark Bomber, I just used that body, and yeah, I'm pretty happy with it. Okay, this isn't not, this is not sticking. Now, uh, next up is Sky. 
Uh, I actually, so I see a lot of people when they make custom minifigures, they sometimes use like clay or, or like a mold or something, a custom mold. So I decided to try using some clay. I know it, I know it doesn't look the best. So I have like her Ollie beanie hat and then her hair didn't turn out the greatest. Uh, and then I have like her camera and her sweatshirt and stuff. And finally is TN Tina, which is one of my, uh, is my favorite skin. Uh, um, she, she, she's one of my favorite skins, but, uh, she's my favorite season two battle pass skin. I just used that. She, uh, so I just took, like, the Ninjago movie Lloyd hair and, uh, sharpied it brown. And then the rest of it was kind of easy. The torso or the body or whatever you call it was kind of hard. It says, I don't, it's kind of hard to read, but it says Kaboom, just like on Tiantina's shirt. So, thank you guys for watching this video today. I hope you enjoyed it, and make sure to like and subscribe to my channel if you, are, if you haven't already. And if you did enjoy this review, please, um, please like the video and comment down below what was your favorite skin and maybe other skins i could make for you guys so yeah i'll see you guys next time